Okay, so sorry about that, guys. Um, my computer crashed, so I'm gonna make this in two parts, maybe, or I might combine them together, like in the same video, but it might be two parts. So as I was saying, we're making the combination one, two, four, and three. So um. If you didn't see the first part, this wouldn't make any sense to you, so go see the first part if you, um, if you have not seen, well, you know, the first, I don't know. So, if you haven't seen the first part. So, once we do the combination, there's one, two, four, and three now. Now, if we try four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, that was, that was the old combination, so if we try that, it shouldn't work. As you can see, nothing happens because we tried typing the old combination, so we changed the combination. Okay, so the co the new combination is one, two, four, three. So let's try one, two, four. Sorry about the noise in the background. Three. So as you can see, the light turns on because we typed in the right combination. Now we'll see how this works. It's a little complicated. I won't explain the whole thing. I will not make a tutorial, of course, because the wiring is so big. This co this machine took me three hours to build. Okay, so I'll do a brief explanation on this. This is the control panel where you can change the combination. So obviously, um, each button. So the first one, for example, it will go to the pink circuit, which goes and feeds into the wiring. So this leads to this piece, these, these, uh, these four repeaters, which will be on. See how there's pistons that push up one of these blocks. So the first repeater will go to the first input right here. And I'm not explaining this really good. I hope I don't know if you understand, but okay. So if this, if this if this repeater was powered, see how the redstone goes all the way up here and goes to this repeater right here, and then it'll power this, which is the first number of the combination. So, if, if this repeater gets powered, it will power this one, the where, where my crosshair is. That's the second number, then the third number, and the fourth number, with the fourth number, which is the green block where I'm pointing at. So, and so on. So this will go to the fourth number, third number, second number, and first number. So what, what happens if I flip one of the combinations? So this is the first button. So if I flip this, go all the way over here. As you can see, this block extends. So if I were to put a torch here, as you can see, it gets powered. Now, that is being powered, which, is the, which toggles the first number of the combination. And if I, so, let me just, so, um, so for the second number, if I were to do, this one is number two, so now, now, now I have to press this the second time, this gets extended, this is only for button one, there's four of these, so, you press, so if I press the second one, it will power this too. So this just resets it all. Okay, so so the first one, so the hold on a second. I'm taking a video. Sorry. Sorry about that. Um. So um, that was for this blue circuit here is for the first button. That's only for the first button. The whole blue circuit. And then the, uh, okay, let's put that down. The second one goes to a green circuit. So, so, blue is the first circuit, first button. Second button, orange is third, I mean, red is third, and orange is fourth. So if I were to flip up a green one, there's another one way over here, that, this is the second button, 
So if I were to, one of these pistons should have went up. Oops, wrong one. So the second one is green. Then we'll, um, extend this piston. This is the same thing as the blue. This is the same as that. So, um, there's four of them, which each go into each one. So, if I were to power, so, put them so the third one is red. So, so the red one's over, the red one's down here, actually. Here's the red ones, here's another one, and the fourth one. The fourth one's way over here, right down here. So it's the same thing for each one. So, um, that's how it works. So if I were to flip, there's torches behind it. So if I were to flip this one, oops, this one, as you can see, there's a redstone torch that turns on. The redstone goes all the way over here, and then goes all the way over here. Then it goes down to a repeater that extends that piston right here. And if I were to do, if I were to do all of them, you hear some of them because some some of them are close by. Um. So as you can see, in each each circuit, all of the blocks are up. You know. So. You don't want multiple levers up because then you'll, then you can't even type in the combination at all. So here's another one, and another one, and the last one. See how the blocks are all up? So, um, I don't know how long this video is. So, I guess that's it. So. This is the most insane creation on Minecraft I've ever made in my life. This one you can hear the pistons because it's just right there. Okay, so. Now let's do one final test. We'll do. We'll do two. Build it. Oops. Wait, hold on. So we'll do. Let's do one. Two. Three, four, four. So now it's one, two, three, four. So as you can see, once it's one, two, three, four. Because this is one. So, of course, you know that. So this one's up. So let's go to number two. See, number two is up. We could go to red, which is number three. As you can see, the third block is up, and we're going to get to number four. The fourth one's up. So the fourth one's up. So then that's basically how it works. I don't know if I explained very well. I suck at explaining. So I do one, two, Three, three. Ignore that sign. That's not the combination anymore. And you can see it lights up. So that's it. So Rivesmaster three one here. Please comment, rate, subscribe. Bye.